Hi Cancer, welcome to my channel Cancer. I hope you are doing well. I hope you're fine and safe and doing good. Oopsie. This reading for today, this is for the sign of Cancer, please. I hope you are doing well. I hope you are fine and safe and doing good. Let us see what is your collective reading. We will look into love, career, money, and general situationship. Okay? I'm doing this on the day of the full moon. Oh, wow. Let's see what's coming towards you. This is for the sign of cancer. Please, you have a page of cups. What can I get for your sign? You have a nine of swords. What is the message that is meant for you to know and ready for you to know? What can I get for the cancer sign, please? Okay. You have an Eight of Cups. Let's see what's coming towards you. Let's look into love, career, money, and general situationship. What can I get for the Cancer sign? You have the Hermit card. You have the Seven of Wands. Okay. All right. Okay, let's start your reading. So, Cancer, you're starting with the Ace of Swords. You have the Page of Cups. You have the Five of Swords. You know this Ace of Swords? Um... The Ace of Swords, it's connected to someone younger than you. Um, this, the energy, the energy connected to Ace of Swords and Page of Cups, this is definitely a situation in the past. Now, the Ace of Swords is connected to a Page of Cups. The Ace of Swords, this is a solid friendship, a solid beginning. There was, there was something solid you built with this person. It could also be like a solid plan. It we it it weaken up, you know, like from something solid, it downgraded to a page of cups. So, like something so strong, it went to weak. Okay, so there was a situation that solid, then weak, it downgraded with the Ace of Swords, the page of cups. They're waiting for you. You love this person, or you like this person. Or you want this project or plan to work out but as you build the energy together or as you put effort and energy towards this plan or situation you realize that it's not strong enough like you started something solid and it went down to a page of swords so you still want it and they still want it whether it's a person a project a plan an aspiration you still want it your interest is weak now because of the downgrade but you still want it okay yeah you could be dealing with scorpio pisces cancer but there's a past situation past energy where up until now you still want it your interest or love or feelings it might have decreased but, but you still want it okay now the connecting energy between you and this situation is the five of swords you still have a chance cancer straightforward there's some weakness in the plan like there's a hole in the plan there's a weakness there's a weak spot in the connection there's a weak spot in the friendship there's some fault in the dating and the getting to know. There's something of a weak spot into a, an ace of swords. Something you built solidly or you're building solidly with a person, a situation. There is a weak spot, the page of cups. And I think by now you know the weak spot, the fault in the stars. You know it now. In the past, you couldn't figure it out. I don't think you want this to end. And I don't think they want it to end. Um, the Nine of Swords. Look at that. This is the Nine and the Ace of Swords. This makes up the Ten of Swords. So this whole thing where there's a weak spot, it's not over. You still have one more chance to the situation or person. Or you have the last say, the last call, the final call, okay? Because if you look at the Nine of Swords, if you look at this person, he's looking at the Ace of Swords. And the Ace of Swords is here. 
so if you ignore all of this ignore that ignore this and focus on the one sword it's a strong second chance cancer that's the advice to you or by now you know that if you eliminate all of if you eliminate the weak spot you would know what to do let's look at the person or the situation involved let's get one more card for you they will consider it they're considering it someone is considering to try would like to try they still have their eyes for you you still have a chance the rose is so like if you look at the rose in the middle it's so fresh like it's so fertile fertile yeah and here all hope is not lost it's one text one call one tap one attempt yeah it is not you know what this is a nine this is a nine of swords the nine could go to a five of swords you know you might be overthinking like you could be thinking it's so difficult and the other person could be thinking it's so difficult but if you guys think it's easy there is a hack look at that the five of swords this is like something you can hack you know there's a term i've there's like a hackathon or you know you like there is a solution to your problem like you would invent the solution to your problem like whatever this ace of swords that you've gone through in the past you think it's complicated if one of you think it's not complicated they will be able to pull you to think that it's not complicated one of you needs to drive and to think that it's not complicated it's not doable and the other will follow because there's a five of swords i always find a five of swords as like we will invent the solution if you say there's no solution we can invent the solution so there's a solution there's still a final chance like there's a one there's a strong chance strong chance in here but if you do give up that strong chance will give up will you know will follow to if you don't give up the energy won't give up on you but if you give up all all of those hope would be would lost okay but there's a hope it's strong it's stronger if you think it's impossible it's it's not there's a you can invent the answer and they're waiting for you that's what i'm hearing with this past situation although i'm not seeing because i'm channeling the next three seven ten days i'm not seeing a communication from them i'm not seeing a communication from you either but if because this is your reading you might want to communicate it's not too late things might things might turn in like things might move you just wait because it's the full moon today and the full moon will definitely the we're just absorbing the full moon okay we're just absorbing the full moon so once the full the once the full moon settle to us here we will definitely embrace more of our destiny so it might change but right now in terms of real time you still have a chance they're waiting for you there is an answer to your solution okay so don't give up yet don't don't give up it's it's not yet over something is taking place in the background um and i'm also kind of picking up check check something someone online there's some update um you're being divinely watched or divinely guided don't do something impulsive okay excuse me okay now let's see what else is coming towards you cancer you have the five of cups the three of cups you could be missing your friends you know i feel like the five of cups the three of cups in here cancer um i feel like you'll start you'll start to sense ways to connect with your desire with your desired people friendship because the five of cups the five of cups is this longing the five of cups is also 
The Five of Cups is longing, sadness, or loneliness. But this is something that you will find a way. You'll start to find. You'll 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 like it is giving me this feeling that you will talk. Like you will talk your sense. Like you're you're gonna make sense of this Five of Cups. Like if you're sad, you will find out why you're sad, and you will be able to start to sense ways out of this Five of Cups. The the full moon. The full moon is probably assisting and helping you to make sense of this five of cups because from five to three, this is like, okay, I'm sad, I'm lonely, I'm feeling isolated, but I now understand why and I now understand how to counter the five of cups because you have the five and the three and the three of cups is like, this is dating, getting to know friendship catch up this is celebrating this is enjoying and spending time with people that makes you happy cheerful and inspired so you will start to make your way out of the five of cups by catching up with the right people connection that cheers you up inspires you uh, make you feel good and really really uh satisfying the eight of cups okay the eight of cups this is connected to what the universe would like to support you and what your higher self would be encouraging you the universe is encouraging you and your higher self is encouraging you to move on from cups okay people connection that does not reciprocate you okay because the eight of cups is that this is emotionally detaching from people or situation or activities or aspiration or plan that makes you sad that makes you feel alone that makes you feel feel empty or that disconnected you or failed you because we're sad because we failed we're sad because something of a bad experience so your higher self in the universe is supporting that hey cancer go to the three of cups go catch up with your friends that makes you happy go do activities and plan you know experience it enjoy life and experience more it will detach you from the loneliness i think by now you would know what to do because it's already such the center of the reading like spend time with people that really ignites your spirit do activities that would lift you up and detach with people or situation that makes you feel unwanted, unloved, underappreciated. Because certainly there are other peoples who would be embracing you and would love to have you in their life in here. The, the Eight of Cups, it's possible, Cancer, that you are so focused with people who is not responsive. You're forgetting people who's responsive of you okay don't forget that yes um you will make your way out of the five of cups okay you will be able to activate the sense of authority to tell yourself this is not working emotionally attach detach and celebrate your life your time with poop with people who's there for you or experiences or plans that would ignite your spirit again look at that yeah i feel like you're gonna say goodbye to a lot of people or at least the six of cups is that people connection that people connection or plans that didn't work out you will find you will have an emperor energy to to move your thoughts to make your sense away of that and eventually you'll find the three of cups you'll find a way to inspire your life or connect with people that inspire you you're gonna be an emperor soon by now you could be an emperor where you're gonna empower yourself look you don't want me I don't want you to okay I'm not gonna force myself I'm gonna find my person or people connection that cheers me up that will embrace me okay this experience this plan it didn't work out that's a redirection let me activate my emperor energy so I can move forward to the next experience, to the next plan, to the next, to the next, to the left, to the left. Okay? So you 
are going to find your way back to where you belong or your welcome or what's next okay and this is a valid feelings and you went through this and then eventually you're going to get out because the hidden energy is the star card the star card is hope fate or you will once you activate the emperor you're going to be spiritually aligned to your journey to your aspirations to the right people that would contribute to your spiritual alignment to your spiritual growth the star card is very spiritual look at that okay so this could be your full moon reading where in you inside of you cancer is an emperor that you would activate it would be ignited soon if not now soon you will realize that you have the power to say or to stay here or to find a new people or connect with people or new adventure you you will know that okay you're gonna activate that okay because there's a three of cups already it means that there are existing people connection that's gonna cheer you up right now all you have to do is access that and you have other plans you know that can move you forward so like something is gonna empower you you know something's gonna empower you to be an emperor and it would recalibrate and it will lead you to the star card which is like you're aligned you're back okay now somewhere in the immediate future between July to December the hermit card the seven of wands so you could be the it could be around this could be around the Virgo season or September or it could be seven weeks from now but um, the hermit card this is recluse or I'm quiet and the seven of wands let's look at the seven of wands I'm confused with this person or situation mm. wow it's a two of cups this is money so for some of you you know this could be the same person that you're working on but seven weeks seven days from now or probably around the Virgo season you will get a return of investment and it's coming from a mutual connection or a two of cups I don't think this is a new person but it could be a new job and that in it could be a new ways of money a new job or it could be because the seven of wands stop like they were like the hermit card is that I'm quiet I have to stop I'm ready now so I have an ace of pentacles and a two of cups so um, I'm really getting to vibe in the next seven days or seven weeks or Virgo season you have a mutual person there's something mutual between you and this situation and there's an ace of pentacles the history is that it stop okay I'm gonna get one more. yeah Queen of Wands you know there's an incoming situation where they have to stop working with you or connecting with you or you have to stop doing it but you will be able to continue it you will be able to continue it again with this person or this project would continue and there's money and it's a mutual connection and with finality the queen of wands are gonna be happy like as the hermit card it stop but it will resume with new money with new resources with more availability and it's more livelier the queen of wands like it's more cheerful so it could be friendship it could be money too because the ace of pentacles you could be moving into a new role a new job something is coming and there's money or there's more value and it's not boring it's very alive I think it stopped because it went into a stalemate like you have to stop doing it connecting with it it's coming back it's more energetic there's more value and you would agree 
even to disagree, you would agree. So there's so much mutual energy between the two of you. Wow, this is great. It could also be around the Leo season, which is happening pretty much soon. So watch for the space because it looks exciting. Okay. This is what I have for you. Thank you so much, guys, for supporting the channel. Thank you so much, guys, for being here. I'm hearing the word, the lost and found, because there's a stop. You've lost them, now you've found them. It's like a dream come true. I'm also hearing the word dream come true. This is good. Thank you, guys, for your support. I will see you soon. You have a great day. Bye-bye.